That is really cool. That's where Spam I never came knew from. that. Yeah. Fresh Daily with Tom and Loggie on K Rock 955. Yes, every Friday morning we send you off to work with some fun and interesting facts that you can use to impress your workmates who aren't your real mates, but it is important that they think you're smart because then when an opportunity comes up in the workplace, for example, a pay rise or a promotion, they'll say, hey, give it to Gary or Karen. They're obviously very smart, very good at their job. They're always full of fun and interesting facts. Close. No, no, it was still bad. really good. Not too bad. No, it was great. There was a, there was no, it was just that little bit at the end when your brain's like... Errant f- in No, there. that's okay. That was really good. Okay. I love you. Thanks, mate. <laughs> also, I was doing it to a camera. I know you were. And your face is right behind the I camera. I know, that's so why I really was looking first and then I, I was looking away. I appreciated that. <laughs> While I humiliate myself. Don't, don't look at me. Uh, okay, so fun facts for today. Did you know that Tutankhamun's tomb contained a collection of boomerangs? Get out! I had no idea that he'd done a royal visit to Australia at some point. No, me. <laughs> <laughs> That's that is very interesting. Yeah. Uh, La Paz in Bolivia has traffic zebras to direct traffic and make sure drivers obey road rules near zebra crossings. And when I say traffic zebras, that's what they look like. Mate, I don't have my glasses on Okay, well, there's, sorry, they're, people dressed, they're people dressed up as zebras. Oh, okay, thank God. Mm. I thought, they're using animals again? Jesus. <laughs> do, you do, do you not? No, I know. Anyway, it's, glasses, hard, it's glasses hard for me. Glasses for work? Huh? Glasses for work? Is that not the time to bring your glasses? Oh, yes, but sometimes we forget things, Tom, oh, in life. Okay. Right. Just like I sometimes just thought, we stuff up a Fun Fact Friday thing. Well, just know, I, just know, just like, I, I wear my pants to work every day. I just feel like glass. I, I, hey, I don't know. I don't do glasses. I, and, and my sunglasses, I lose. I just thought just thought that'd be. Crayfish become more adventurous <laughs> on antidepressants. Did you know that? Oh, into, don't we all? They're more into experimenting. <laughs> oh, yes. Spam email got its name from a Monty Python sketch in which shouting spam drowns out all other converse- conversation. That is really cool. That's where spam I never came knew from. that. Yeah. Um, pet snails can't travel on high-speed trains in France unless they have a ticket. <laughs> the French, mate. Don't even get me started. Pet snails? Yeah. Don't it, uh, it, uh, okay, it. yeah. Bees on cocaine tend to overestimate their nectar and pollen-gathering skills. Okay, what's the deal with animals on drugs in this I don't fun know. fact? <laughs> I don't know, mate. <laughs> and I'm going to wrap it with this one. The Danish phrase – I'm going to have a go at it. Er det hesten fødelsdag. Yes. <laughs> literally translates to – is it the horse's birthday? <laughs> Which actually means this rye bread is too thick for my open sandwich. I'm so confused. So you bring me the bread to make my sandwich and you've cut it too thick. And I say to you, Oh! A Fudelstag? <laughs> Which means, is it the horse's birthday? What are you doing, woman? <laughs> I don't know what that accent was. Fresh Daily with Tom and Loggy on K-Rock 955.